Moving on to division. In both year three and year four, we do tens and units divided by units. So when we talk about division, the proper terminology we need to use is the dividend divided by the divisor is the quotient, equals the quotient. Now there are lots of different ways of doing this. The first method we're going to look at, again, both the year threes and the year fours use it. And it's using this idea of partitioning and the distributive law that we looked at in multiplication earlier. So for example, if I wanted to do 92 divided by 4. First of all, I'm going to think about what numbers that are divisible by 4 and make up my large number, my dividend. So in this distance, I could think of 40, and I'm going to divide that by 4. I've taken away 40, so that means I've got 52 left. I could do 40 divided by 4 again. 40, 40 is 80, that leaves me with 12. And 12 is divisible by 4. So I'm going to do my answers for each one. 40 divided by 4 is 10. Add 10 again. Add 3 would be 23. That's one way that I could split it up or redistribute it. I could do it another way. For example, I could do 60 because that's divisible by 4. I've got 60 and I want 92, that means I've got 32 left and luckily 32 is also divisible by 4. So I could do 32 divided by 4. Now 60 divided by 4 is 15, 32 divided by 4 is 8 and 15 add 8 is again 23. One final example, I could do it in large chunks. I could do 80 divided by 4. I want 92, so I've got 12 left. So I'm going to do 12 divided by 4. I'm going to work out what each of those answers are. 8 divided by 4 is 2, so 80 divided by 4 is 10 times bigger, so that'd be 20. Add 12 divided by 4, which is 3. And so my overall answer, or quotient, would be 23.